Good morning. Welcome to the WCCE Morning News Show. My name is Avery and I'll be your anchor for today, Monday, February 3rd, 2020. This is day seven for activity classes. Here's Riley with the weather. The current temperature in Clo so Clover, South Carolina is 41 degrees. Today's high is 73 degrees. The low for tonight is 53 degrees. The forecast for today is partly cloudy. Now back to our anchor. Thank you. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I salute to the flag of South Carolina and pledge to the power of the state, love, loyalty, and faith. At Crowder's Creek, we pledge to seek smart solutions beyond borrowed learning, act responsibly, and respect others. Now for a moment of silence. Today for lunch, we will have pepperoni, pizza, pasta bake, cheeseburgers, and yogurt and animal cracker fun lunch. Dr. Dickey, Miss Hamilton, Mr. Craig, and Miss House would like to wish a happy birthday to Stephanie Amon a and Ava Dupont. Your teacher will provide you with your birthday pencil. Good morning. This month, your goal as a student at CCE is to show compassion. We show compassion by reaching out to others and letting others know that we care for them. To feel and show compassion, we must first be able to think about how others feel. We can show compassion to other students by helping them with their work. We can show compassion by reaching out when someone is upset. We can even show compassion when someone is not showing that they are sad, even though something hurtful or unfair has happened. For an example, if someone says a hurtful thing to another student, we can say something to a student like, hey, are you okay? Or, I'm sorry about what that person said to you. It really helps to know that others care about us and we are not alone. Remember to show compassion and have a great day. Good morning, students. Ms. Green and I have a very exciting announcement to make. Starting today, CCE will begin celebrating kindness. Kindness is a way that we show others that we care. Some simple acts of kindness that you can add to your day are holding a door for someone, giving a friend a compliment, or inviting someone to play with you. These are very simple things that you can add to your day to show kindness. We will also be putting up an interactive display in the cafeteria. Teachers, if you see a student showing an act of kindness to another, please, we encourage you to take a picture of them being the eye in kindness. In addition to our kindness display, we'll also have a 28-day challenge where students will be given one of these sheets. We have one for boys and one for girls. You will complete a random act of kindness, and as you complete your random act, you will cross it off of the list. So for example, be a problem solver. So if you're a problem solver and you figure out how to resolve your own issue or conflict that you have with another student, go ahead and mark it off. When you've completed all of the random acts of kindness, you'll simply turn this into your teacher. Now students, some of these random acts of kindness will appear more than one time on the sheet. If it appears more than one time, you need to do that random act more than once to cross it off. Um, so again, turn these into your teacher when you're finished. On, by the end of the day on February 26th because we're going, going to have a drawing where we'll give a prize to one person for each grade level and then we'll have a grand prize that we'll give one, one for a student on the primary side and a grand prize for the, a student on the elementary side. So you don't want to miss this opportunity to be entered into this drawing. So students, let's make this a great month and show kindness today and every day. Good morning CCE students and staff. I just wanted to say thank you to the YMCA students for doing the right thing. We had a great time playing in the gym on Friday. I had 20 friends that were selected to come over and play and I look forward to another great week and hopefully maybe we can play again on Friday. So remember to be caught doing the right thing and when the tickets are drawn be doing the right thing as well so that we can um, go and play next door. Have a great day. Happy Monday, boys and girls. I hope you had a wonderful weekend and you were able to enjoy that beautiful weather yesterday. I think we're going to have some amazing weather again today. Hopefully you also were able to enjoy the Super Bowl and hopefully your team win. won. Unfortunately, my team wasn't even in it, but better luck next year. 
This week is going to be a great week, uh, certainly a busy week. We'll have our dental presentations this week. Please be sure to refer to the information sent by our school nurses. And boys and girls, if you'll make sure you're on your best behavior when you're listening to information on how we can best maintain good dental hygiene and dental care. And now for my favorite part of the morning where I get to invite a special guest to the sore sofa. And this morning we are inviting Gus Seegers from Miss Lazaric and Miss O'Neill's fifth grade class. Welcome Gus, how are you? Good. Well, let me read to you a little bit about what his teachers had to say. Gus is always respectful no matter what the situation is. He comes to school with a smile on his face and a positive outlook for the day. He always does what he is asked to do without hesitation. When showing respect to others, Gus is a model student. Wow, Gus, that is awesome. Boys and girls, there's nothing better than being around someone who is positive and who does the right thing. Those are certainly kind of role models and friends that you want to have and that you want to associate yourself with. So Gus, I appreciate you always being respectful to both your peers and um, the adults in the building because that is so important to make sure that you are showing respect. So here's a pencil that says my principal is proud of me as well as your special eagle ring. Do you have any advice you want to give our other CCE friends? Keep on sewing. Keep on sewing, boys and girls, and please remember to show respect and demonstrate excellence in everything you do. If you do those things, you will certainly go very far in life. Have a great day. Thank you for watching the WCCE Morning News Show. Have a great day.